With age, insufficient tryptophan in the diet alters the gut microbiota and increases inflammation. In aged mice, eight weeks on a low tryptophan diet results in some unhealthy changes in the trillions of bacteria that comprise the gut microbiota and higher levels of systemic inflammation, according to a new study. The research was funded by the National Institute on Aging, or NIA. The researchers fed the aged mice three different diets for eight weeks. Diets that were deficient had recommended levels and high levels of tryptophan. In the face of low tryptophan, they saw both a direct and indirect impact on the microbiota and it generally set the stage for inflammation body-wide, according to the researchers. There were reduced levels of certain bacteria species, which also had been seen in patients with Crohn's and colitis. The unhealthy changes made the researchers suspect increased release of inflammation-promoting signaling molecules called cytokines, hypothesizing that microbiota changes might induce release of cytokines body-wide. They found significant increases of IL-6, IL-17A, and IL-1A, and a significant decrease in IL-27, a cytokine which prevents transcription of inflammation invoking IL-17 and helps do things like increase regulatory T cells in the gut, which suppress inflammation. Conversely, mice on a tryptophan-rich diet had higher levels of calming IL-27. If you're looking for some extra recent high quality longevity content, then we recommend you watch this video from popular YouTuber Thomas DeLauer about fasting, aging, and longevity, summary of Dr. David Sinclair's research. I've been subscribed to his YouTube channel since 2017, so I'm very excited that Thomas is starting to shift his content to focus on longevity and that he's a fanboy of David Sinclair like me. You'll find a link to this video in the description below. Subscribe to our X10 YouTube channel for more videos.